In ancient times, manganese and magnesium were mined in magnesia in modern day Greece. I guess back in the day, straight out of magnesia really meant something. Manganese is a type of transition metal. Common examples are iron, copper, gold, and silver. Transition metals play a critical role in normal physiologic processes. They're important for energy production, building new substances, and to boost the body's natural antioxidant defenses. So how does manganese promote bone, muscle, and joint health? One mechanism is its role as a cofactor for enzymes called glycosyl transferases. As the name would imply, these enzymes move sugar from one substance to another substance. Important sugar protein molecules in bone, joint, and muscle health are substances called proteoglycans and glycoaminoglycans. Examples would be conjointin sulfate, hyaluronic acid, and glucosamine. In bones and joints, these uh, substances provide strength, shock-absorbing properties, and lubrication. Additionally, manganese magnifies the effectiveness of estrogen and insulin growth like factor one, both very important hormones in bone and muscle health. Manganese is also a critical cofactor for superdioxide dismutase, one of the body's most formidable natural antioxidant defenses. Superdioxide dismutase resides in the mitochondria. The mitochondria is the power generator of the cell and it's the area where most free radicals are generated. When manganese combines with superdioxide dismutase, it's able to neutralize and counteract the free radical toxins. Excessive free radical injury and oxidative stress is a driving force behind many musculoskeletal disease states. Excellent sources of manganese are pumpkin seeds, garbanzo beans, cloves, and spinach. In truth, you take a cup of spinach, you take a handful of pumpkin seeds, that gives you twice the dietary allowance. You don't need supplementation, you just gotta eat smart and nutritious.